one of my favorite players uh, in the NBA the last few years has been Boogie Cousins. Yeah. I know he's had to work on being a leader. I know he's had to uh, work on uh, just the, the way he approaches the game. But when I saw this the other night, the way he's been putting up numbers, the way he's been a, a good citizen in New Orleans yeah, yeah. And, and been there for his teammates, it's just sad, Zeke. It, it, it really is because here's a guy that I think all of us as players and former players, we look at Cousins, and that, that's, the, that's a guy that we root for because I think all of us see a little bit of him in ourselves yeah. because you know that once he matures and grows, that there's something about him that's really special. Yeah. And to see him go down with an injury like that, or for the season that he was having, you know, I, my heart goes out to Damn. him. And I hope rehab goes well. And I hope he gets back up because that was a guy who was on the right path. Yeah. You know, Absolutely. Zeke, me and you both had that same injury. And, you know, that's an injury that, that just comes out of nowhere. What's the toughest didn't... part about it? I mean, well, I knew I wasn't coming back from my injury. But you, any move you make, mm. it can go. Because when it decides, you know, when, when it says I'm ready to go, you can <laughs> yeah. go. I mean, oh, man. Only thing he did was shoot a free throw and follow it and just took one little simple step off the leg and it yeah, popped. Yeah, freaky, man. So, uh, you know, my advice to him is just, hey, rehab, stay in shape. You know, don't, don't get too out of shape. Rest and, you know, eat right, do right. And then just, you know, before you succeed, you must first learn to fail. It's just another, you know, something to, you know, make him grow stronger. So next year, you should say, you know what, I'm going to rehab and work my butt out this summer. And I'm gonna come back even stronger because he was having a phenomenal year. Yeah. We should bring him up here. Smarter. He should come join players. Yeah, yeah, come yeah, on up yeah, here, yeah, players. We had fun joining. up here. We wasted we're, time. With we're you. rehabbing. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> <laughs> what you no, think? But I, but I, I, I also, uh, to Shaq point, saying that when this guy takes his time and on his way and his road to recovery, that when he comes back, he'll probably play a lot smarter. You know, like getting back in the block, you know, picking shots, picking his spots not trying to do everything, because I think this year he showed us, all right, I'm mature, I can do everything. I can push the ball, shoot the three. I think when you come back from that injury, you'll start to move, you know, a little slower, have a little bit more pace, but he'll be a lot smarter and, and probably more effective for the team. You know, one piece of advice I got for him, guys, I want you to see if y'all agree, and this is just from my own body, but probably affects you guys too. Now he has to go about five years earlier into taking care of his body. What yeah. I mean is... Yeah. You got to be skinnier. Yep. You yeah. got to lose yeah. weight. You can't carry all that yeah. weight around. Shaq, when I, the older I got, the harder it was to get off because you can't work out like that anymore. Yeah. So right now, if he come back like that, you know, <laughs> all right, Hulk Hogan. <laughs>